Hey guys, I'm back for another video and welcome to another Minecraft plugin tutorial. And in this one, I'm going to be teaching you guys how to use the Multiverse Portals plugin. What Multiverse Portals allows you to do is make portals between different locations or worlds, such as this one. And as you can see, there doesn't need to be a block there. You can just walk right up and boom, teleported. And it also works between worlds. Of course, I am in the survival world right now, and now I can go into creative just like that. There is a prerequisite to this plugin. You're going to need to install Multiverse Core if you want to get this to work. So to get started, you're going to want to do in chat slash NVP wand. Now, as you can see, it says I have world edit installed. And since I do, I'm going to do slash slash wand. But if you don't want to use a command, you can just get a wooden axe. That's the default. For this example, I'm going to be using cobblestone. So let's make our first portal. So I'm just going to build a portal. Doesn't really matter what size or shape. I'm going to, you can make them like this. You can make one like this tiny little portal, but I'm going to go with the standard nether portal size. So then I'm going to place in some panes, which look nice. You don't need to put blocks in the middle, but I do it because it looks nicer. So then you get your ax, you left click on the top corner. It doesn't matter what corner. So that corner, for example, and then you right click on the other corner, the one opposite to it. So boom. Now I've selected this entire thingy here, and then I type in this command slash MVP create, and then you type in your portal name tutorial one, right? MVP create tutorial one. So there you go. Now we've created tutorial one. Of course we run into it. Nothing happens because it's a fresh portal. It has nowhere to go. I'm going to make the second one right here for now. So we can do this. And again, this will work between worlds. So I could go into the nether and then make another portal. It doesn't really matter. So there you go. There's portal number two. And then I do the same thing. Let's do a different corners this time. Boom, boom. Doesn't matter. Again, as long as you get this whole rectangular area selected using the axe. And then I'm going to do slash MVP create tutorial two. And there you go. Now we have tutorial one and tutorial two. Of, again, if we try running through, nothing's going to happen because they're not linked. So now what we can do is we use the linking command. Uh, so what we're going to do, since we just created tutorial two, that is the portal that's selected by us in the plugin right now. So what we can do is slash MVP modify dest, so it's destination, and then P colon, so that P means portal, and then we put in the portal we want to go to. So again, we're selecting portal two. So then we're just going to do tutorial one, the property destination of portal two or portal two tutorial two was set to tutorial one. So if I walk through here, boom, I pop out the other side. Now, again, this won't work. This is a one way process. So now if we want to make it a two way process, so again, we can run through, boom, come out the other side, run through again, a boom, come out the other side. <laughs> So now we're going to want it to be a two way portal. So then what we do is slash MVP select tutorial one. So now we've selected tutorial one and then we do the modify destination command again. MVP modify destination P colon tutorial two. And now if we walk in, boom, we pop out the other side. Boop. Boop. <laughs> so yep now it's a two-way process i'm gonna have to do slash mvp remove tutorial two so that's the command for getting rid of portals and now if i've done that correctly boop, now i'm in a completely different world and then boop, now i'm here again if i do slash mv info it says there you go i'm in the survival world right and then i go boop and then i do slash mv info again that's the creative world. So they're separate worlds completely. It works between dimensions. So you can do the end, the nether, and all these things. And I've used these portals on the server to bring people all around the map. So you have the skyblock portal brings you to the skyblock world. Boom. Here we are. So that's it for this tutorial, guys. There's more things you can do in this plugin, but that is the basics of it. I'll be leaving the documentation for this plugin in the description down below if you want to investigate a little bit further. And I'm also going to leave a download link to the plugin itself. Again, if you want to use it, whether you're using bucket, spigot, bungee cord, any of that, uh, you can or sponge, I think is another one. You can just plop it in your plugins folder 
and again you need multiverse core as well to make this work and it's preferable if you have world edit because it makes things a little bit nicer well anyway that's it so i hope you guys enjoyed and i'll see you guys later